friends welcome to technique this is normal here and in this video we're going to do the detailed faq on the vivo z1 pro so vivo z1 pro is the latest uh, device to be announced uh, by the company so the device comes with a fully loaded hardware it comes with a qualcomm snapdragon 712 octagon processor it has 4 gigabyte ram as well as 6 gigabyte ram so in this video we'll specifically do an faq covering all the doubts we have got from our views so let's get started with the detail faq first step let's have a look at uh, the sensors included on this device so we have installed the sensors app on this device so uh, opening up the sensors app you can see that it comes with all the basic sensor magnetic sensor proximity gyroscope accelerometer light uh, all the sensors are included on the vivo z1 pro now talking about the display quality so this device comes with a, a 6.53 inches of full hd plus resolution display and you can see that this device comes with ips lcd panel unlike uh, uh, the vivo's v series phones this is a, this does not have an emulate panel this has an ips lcd panel but uh, nevertheless this device looks good in terms of display performance you can see the colors are vibrant uh, and uh, touch response also feels very smooth so overall display quality uh, feels quite good uh, for the price segment it is being offered so we don't have much to complain in the display department so overall even the outdoor visibility also was pretty good now talking about uh, the gorilla glass protection so there is no mention of gorilla glass on this device we have uh, asked vivo for a confirmation on this so we are assuming that there is no support for gorilla glass on this device because uh, vivo has not mentioned uh, any support on the display now talking about the sim card so we have uh, uh, two sim cards uh, slots here so this has dedicated sd card support so you can expand the storage uh, on this device without having to compromise on two sim cards so both the sim card supports um, uh, dual volte and uh, you can use uh, geo sim cards or any other airtel or any other sim cards with volte on this device there is dual volte support on the vivo z1 pro now talking about the storage variant there are three variants available uh, one is uh, the 4 gigabyte ram 64 gigabyte storage 6 gigabyte ram 64 gigabyte storage and 6 gigabyte ram 128 gigabyte storage so these are the three variants available there are two colors available uh, we have the blue variant and also the black variant also comes uh, uh, on the vivo z1 pro now talking about the fingerprint scanner so the fingerprint scanner is really fast on this device so you can see that it's extremely fast performance and even the face unlock feels very fast you can see that uh, you can also have a look at the face unlock here so there you go it's very fast uh, face unlock on the vivo z1 pro now talking about the software so the device comes with a uh, fun touch OS. so we have seen fun touch OS on uh, vivo's other uh, devices as well uh, so if you go to the about phone uh, you can uh, see all the details fun touch OS version uh, is uh, 9 you can uh, see 9 is version and android 9.0 is also the version and uh, security level is from june 2019 and uh, the processor is qualcomm snapdragon 712 and we have the 6 gigabyte ram on uh, uh, this device now talking about the performance of this device so this device has really good performance with the qualcomm snapdragon 712 and we have done a detailed gaming video where we found the gaming to be really good it's a superior processor with the 4 and 6 gigabyte ram being offered and uh, vivo z1 pro uh, is uh, specifically made for gaming that's the intent of uh, the vivo's uh, z1 pro so vivo is making this device uh, uh, or rather uh, advertising this device as a gaming device so there are lots of gaming modes also on offer on this device so the performance is really good now talking about the battery the device comes with a 5000 mAh large capacity battery and the battery performance is really good if you could get almost like two days of battery life uh, screen on time could be anywhere between uh, 9 to 10 hours we can't really say the screen on time because vivo software does not allow it but uh, our estimates uh, say that around 9 to 10 hours of screen on time is possible on this device because it has a large capacity battery now charging time there is an 18 watt fast charger included so uh, the fast charger is not as fast because it's it's a large capacity battery it could it can take around two and a half hours to charge the device initially it's fast but uh, over a period of time it gets slow uh, 0 to 100 takes around two and a half hours uh, with the 18 watt fast charger remember it has a 5000 mAh capacity battery now next moving on to the speaker performance so we have a, a, a track from youtube's audio library let's play this track So you can see that the speakers at the bottom looks adequately loud enough uh, 
for music playback and uh, watching videos so that's uh, the speaker performance now talking about uh, led notifications on this device so we'll just connect uh, a charger to this device and see if there is any notification so there you go so we can't uh, see any led notification on this device so led notification is missing on the vivo z1 pro now talking about the usb otg functionality as yes, this device supports otg out of the box you can see that there is an option to enable otg on this device now talking about the camera quality so we have done a detailed video on the camera features and camera samples so you can check out that video we'll uh, uh, we'll talk about the camera in our detailed camera review so it looks pretty good in terms of the camera performance there is electronic image stabilization on offer for the 1080p sample there is also 4k recording available so overall it's a triple camera setup uh, it's a 16 8 and uh, bokeh camera included and a 32 megapixel in display camera so overall the camera performance definitely looks good now talking about the availability this device uh, will be launched on july 3rd we'll get to know the pricing uh, on july 3rd it should be really competitively priced and the device will go on sale on flipkart so it could be a flipkart exclusive device it may not come offline actually uh, we're not really sure on that but it might be an online only device and uh, it will be available on flipkart now other uh, features uh, uh, we have been getting a lot of uh, questions asking whether there is wide one l1 support so uh, we'll just test that so you can see that uh, there is no wide one l1 support the security level is l3 so uh, l1 support is not included now camera to apa that's one thing uh, a lot of uh, guys might be interested so you can see that there is limited support available on this device so there is no uh, full support but then um, uh, you can we'll just try uh, whether this device works with uh, uh, the gcam app available so we'll try installing gcam and we'll let you know later so as of now the there is limited uh, hardware level support for camera to api so these are the FAQs on the Vivo Z1 Pro. The device will be launched on July 3rd. So you'll get to know the pricing on July 3rd. So that's all guys. Hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you still have any questions to ask, you can just drop a comment and we'll be glad to help you out with your questions. So this is Nirmal signing off. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in our next video. Have a great day.